There's a warm up guys, 20 backflip burpees. I don't know if you guys saw the last Thenx episode where I showed these guys, Zay and Brian, how to do some backflips. So since we were in that mood already, I thought we'd throw it into the workout. So let me show you guys the workout for today. So we are getting close. Today is day 26. We're getting close to day 30. I need to up the level because I'm trying to look as beast as possible and trying to be basically as strong as possible. So we're going to put some really high advanced moves into this routine right here. Of course, they'll be modified within the app so everybody can do this routine. But the routine we got for you guys, a whole body workout. It's going to be killer. Are you guys ready for this? The warm up, we just did it. 20 backflip burpees. Let's get right into the workout. It's going to be clean and presses 20 times. Explosive muscle ups 10 times. Box jump pistol squats 1 minute. One arm toaster bars. Assisted one arm straight bar dips. And then we have super Korean dips. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that before, but that move's pretty tough. We're going to max that last move out as many times as we can. And we're going to do that whole entire routine for a total of three rounds. All right, guys, for the cool down, we're going to go into handstands. We're going to do a wide shoulder and close three times each and of course I got a bonus for you guys 90 degree handstand push-ups to finish the routine guys you ready for this let's do a weigh-in really quick all right all right let's go let's go show me something yo 165 that's crazy that's dope honestly the goal is not to weigh more in my opinion my goal is just to put on some more muscle and get stronger of course that's the whole point of this 30 day body transformation right the number of how much you weigh of course is just a reference for example I practically weigh exactly the same from when I first started maybe like one or two pounds maybe three pounds more see I'm only a couple pounds heavier but I feel like way 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 stronger you know those couple pounds make a huge difference let's get into this routine. We interrupt this vlog to bring you some breaking news about the Harrier Pro app. Thousands of you guys have signed up to become beta testers and on March 19th, Monday, you guys are going to get hands-on access a week before everyone else. Now I'm going to show you guys how to create, schedule, and save a workout. Okay, let's begin by creating a workout. Choose your workout type. We're going to go for calisthenics and weights. Choose the workout style. We're going to go for strength building. Which muscle group? Let's go for chest and triceps. How much time do you have to work out? Let's go for 45 minutes. And do you want to warm up? Know it. Choose your level of difficulty. Intermediate. Let's get our workout. All right, so as you can see, here is our routine. If you don't like it, you can hit this and get a new one. If you want to add anything in there, feel free to add some different exercises. If you want to move an exercise, hold right here. Put them into any round. If you want to delete an exercise, come over here, delete. So let's go ahead and save this routine right here. You can choose to schedule your workout right away or save it in a collection for later. So let's save it in one of our collections. Let's make a new collection. Chris Killer Chest Routine, let's do it. So now we're gonna go over to our saved workouts. All right, so if we hit this book icon right here, you will see we have our Chris Killer Chest Routine right here. Custom workout. Here is the routine, guys. If you don't know what the move looks like, hit here to watch the video. So once we save this routine, we can then choose to schedule it to our calendar by clicking that icon. Let's go ahead and make another workout and let's schedule this one right away. So here's our beginner routine. We're gonna go ahead and save it and we're gonna schedule this workout. So if you hit this calendar icon at the bottom left, it should take you to your schedule. So here is our routine for the day. Let's go ahead and schedule it to a further date, March 20th. But if you go to March 20th, you'll see here is our routine and you can go ahead, take the routine. You can also go in and create a custom name for each workout. So that's how you create, save, and schedule a workout. And lastly, one of my favorite features is you can also create workout programs. If you go to programs, add a new program, Chris Chest Program, you can then come in here and add a new day, a workout and you can, guys can keep going as long as you wanna make this program. So if you were to add in the workout for day one, you would go ahead, add that in right there. And there's your workout for day one. Go ahead, rename it, whatever you'd like. And that's how you create a workout program, guys. All right, so the next move we have explosive muscle ups. All right, question. If you need help doing pull-ups and you want to use resistance bands, which one will give you the most help? The red, green, or black one? Well, each resistance band has its own different resistance. I'm pretty sure it says it when you go to thanks.com slash shop, you look for the resistance band. I think the green one, I'm not sure exactly how much pounds it is, but I mean, that thing is like super thick. You can do anything with that. And then the black one, probably I would say like 20 pounds of resistance. And then the red one is like super thin. It's like probably five pounds, 10 pounds, something like that of resistance. But the whole point is you need to train with all of them because you're always at a different stage when you're training. 
maintaining. Muscle-ups, for example, you might need a lot more resistance at the beginning, and the better you get at them, you might need less resistance. The whole point is to reduce the amount of assistance that you have over time so that you're practically doing it by yourself. If that answers your question, each one has its own resistance, and you use each one for depending on what stage you are in for whatever it is you're training. Explosive muscle-ups, let's do it. Much, much later. How many times are we gonna show that meme? We're doing like a million reps here. <sighs> All right, next we have box, jump, pistol squats. Let's keep it going, guys. Actually here at work, I'm doing something that has to do with work, so. One arm toast to the bar. All right, wait, I got one more for you, though. So how often do you eat junk food? Bro, I don't eat junk food, guys. You guys know I, my first meal is like at 3 p.m. I don't got time for junk food. This workout's killer right now, guys. Next one we have is assisted one arm straight bar dip. See, we're doing a lot of isolation calisthenics in one arm. That's really the way to make all these moves a whole lot easier. Obviously, if you do a move with one arm that you normally need two arms to do, you're gonna get to the next level. We got one arm straight bar dip. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Let's get up there. All right, so for this, guys, I'm gonna use a black resistance band. I'm not quite there yet, so I'm not gonna use the red one because I probably won't hit as many reps. Obviously, I'm not gonna use the green one because it's gonna be too easy. Let's get up there. Two more times. Next one is super Korean dips. Let me show you what this looks like. Let me ask you another question though. Go for it, bro. How much sleep do you get on a range? Running a company, YouTube channel, getting your workouts in, and having a kid sounds like a recipe for no sleep at all. Yeah, that does sound like a recipe for no sleep. That's true. It's hard for me to get into sleep, honestly. Sleep is super important, and that's when you make most of your gains, guys. When your body's at rest, basically. But for me personally, I wake up about 8 a.m. I try to go to sleep at 12, but normally I end up going to sleep at like 1 or 2. So that's my sleeping pattern. Alright, let me ask you a question. Thank God. 
Do you do cardio at all? If so, how do you fit it in your day? If not, how would you fit it in? One day train, then one day running? You didn't see this whole routine just now, guys. This cardio all through this shit. Nah, seriously though, I do about like, I'll say about 30 minutes of just like sprinting. We're just like really running basically in the morning as soon as I wake up. Or if I don't do it in the morning, I'll do it at night. And I'll probably do that like five times a week, sometimes four times a week. Also, of course, throughout the week, I always have a designated day just to work out abs, cardio, and high intensity interval training. All right, guys, I have two more rounds of this. Then we got the bonus, 90 degree handstand push-up. Stick around, guys, because I'm going to let you guys know one of the workshops that we have going down in Zurich, Switzerland at the Bar Dogs Gym. Check it out. Woo! Jesus, Woo. we made it guys. Day 26. Oh, oh my God. Yeah, yeah, you good for one last question? All right, one last question. <laughs> What's your favorite exercise? My favorite exercise, definitely not that one. I guess my favorite exercise would have to be the muscle up. Basically, the muscle up started everything for me. It got me in the right mindset. It made everything a whole lot easier. All right guys, I gotta get back to work. Yes, I do other things besides this vlog. We're wrapping up the Harrier Pro app right now so all you beta testers can start on Monday on time. These joggers, by the way, they're gonna be out probably, if not next week, like within the next couple days, for sure. We got a whole bunch more FedEx apparel coming. We got a whole bunch more Chris Harrier apparel coming. So I gotta get back to work. My son is actually sick today, so he's up there right now. Say hi, son. Anyway, I gotta get back to work, so let's sit down and talk about these workshops in Europe. Let's see. Woo! Zurich, we are coming for you guys. Have you guys ever heard of Bar Dogs Gym? Because that's exactly where we're gonna be. Stefan, what date are we gonna be there? April 25th, April 26th, we're gonna be there. We have advanced workshops and we have basic workshops. Check it out, fenix.com slash blog slash events. The link is down in the description below. Shout out to Manuel for hosting us. This is gonna be a crazy workshop, guys. If you are in Zurich or near Switzerland, you wanna make it to this workshop, sign up right now. We'll see you guys there. Also, Austria, we're gonna be in Bregenz just a couple days before we're in Zurich. For more info and to find out how you can attend one of our events, go to fenix.com slash blog slash events. See you guys there. Play video games. How are you, big boy? Say what's up. Hi. Oh, he's a little sick today, guys. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys next Thursday. I gotta take care of my son right now. But next time I upload, let's hear that drum roll. 30 day body transformation will be complete. And I will be sharing you guys the complete body transformation from day one to day 30. So it's gonna be an epic video. Also, the Harrier Pro app is gonna be out and you guys are also gonna be able to start your day one. So next Thursday when I see you guys, download the app, start Start your day one training, train hard, take your day 30 photo, send it in to us for a chance to win $200 worth of Chris Harriet gear, and I will see you guys next Thursday. Boom! Smash that like button, guys.